Mr. Hannan. President, whenever we discuss human rights, we seem to be talking about a virtual EU, uh, a European Union that exists only in Parliament resolutions, Commission press releases, and Council communiques. This is this wonderful, peaceful human rights EU that spreads its values not through daisy cutter bombs, but rather through trade accords or partnership agreements. But I feel it's incumbent on somebody to stand back and say, where is this European Union in the real world? In the real world, Brussels is seeking to sell arms to the communist regime in Beijing and isolating Taiwan. It's cozying up to the Ayatollahs in Tehran. It's refusing to do business with the anti-Castro dissidents in Cuba. It's trying to funnel cash to Hamas. It's running protectorates, satrapies, such as they were in Ottoman days, in uh, Bosnia and in Kosovo. And in its own borders, it is disregarding the will of the people in referendums. Perhaps when we respect that basic right of being able to change your government through the ballot box and change public policy through your vote within the European Union, then we will have earned the moral authority to lecture others. Yeah, yeah, yeah.